however you prefer to pronounce it, is fairly weak. She can be chipped down pretty quickly, and it's all around not the best of things. As I've mentioned, I've already put her in a spot of great danger, but oh well. We're just gonna have to hold out and prove our worth. Probably should have done it the other way where I had her guard, but oh well. Go, that ends our turn. Let's see where we begin. I'm gonna go straight for loot. Okay, well, at least loot will be okay. Get to see her work as a mage knight, which looks pretty sick. I like the animation, it looks really cool. <sighs> But of course, we gotta continue on and be ready for whatever hell they decide to rain upon us. Saving that village, or I think it was saving the Fire Ray Village, is very difficult. I know saving one of these two villages is really hard because of how quickly the units come right at you. Garrick just showing off and getting a crit, but alright. Um, of course, you're gonna wanna hold out for Tethers and just be very wary. Huh, not much more to really say other than just hope that you hold out pretty well. Damn, Garrett, really? You're just showing off now. Two crits in a row. Not bad, I'll take it. My god, no real reason to. Level up, boost to level 11, boost in HP and skill. That's honestly really, really good. Here they come, rushing right at us. And we're not going to waste too much time. <sighs> Taking them on. We have a whole slew of upgraded allies and units to use, so let's just hold out and hold that we do pretty well. Ross with the Sword Slayers. Getting a crit for a turn, that is perfect. We can really, really use that. That'll uh, allow us to preserve that Sword that sword Slayer a lot. You're going to want to keep your tank, your units as, as with as much HP as possible. And basically as tanky as you can cap them. It's a little absurd, yes, but you gotta make do with what we got. Uh, so far so good, been avoiding almost everything, which makes my life easier. And getting crits left and right, which is awesome. There we go. Clearing them up slowly. Yep, this is what I was worried about. Thank goodness this avoids pretty well, but still, it might not hold out pretty long. There we go. Garrick evading, doing pretty well at it. Yep, as expected, you guys are gonna move in. I sometimes wish that units could cross rivers thanks to other units, but unfortunately that doesn't work. Though if that could work, that'd be awesome. Anywho, yep, as expected, you're gonna attack her. She should be okay. She's more than okay, she's evading literally everything, which is awesome. Okay, you're gonna move in, and yep, that's expected. Bolted. Floor Spar, His Majesty gave me this name. Therefore, I. We see here, get straight to work. 21 HP. And Ross just evaded it. Thank you. That is quite literally what I honestly hope for. We're literally gonna have to. We're literally gonna use Ross as a just a hiding tank, I guess. Uh. Doesn't matter which one we use, as long as we can hold out. Boom. Ross's main aim is just to keep his health high and to keep swinging at everything that comes at him. That's literally going to be Ross's main purpose. Ross and Archer are going to act as the diversion, so that way I can close in. Um, I don't have uh, any ranged weapons. You have a javelin. I kind of have to push in, which sucks, because that increases her... Um, well, damage output in general. I need to move Ross in. I need him to swap over to... Which one has the highest? Well, Silver Axe, obviously, but I don't want to use it right away. We'll stick with the Steel Axe. It should be okay. He's still pretty beefy. Go, and he gets a level up, so even more defense or health. More health, skill, and luck. Hey, we'll take it. That's pretty good in my book. On this side, Garrick. You're gonna attack this one first. Boom. Go. Avoiding pretty well and KOing that. Awesome. Then Ted is gonna come in and dance, of course, for the great Garrick. Awesome. 
Now Garrett can swing again. And you don't have to worry about Tess taking too much damage. Um, anything I'm worried about rushing at me? No, not really. We just have Garrick attack from here. There's no point in moving him too much. I don't want him to don't want to send him off to his death so quickly. While we have so much time and so many units to use. So we're just gonna play it safe however we can. We got ourselves the Halberd, which is awesome. A really good weapon. Ugh, now we just keep on pushing in. Your range. Okay, cool. So I don't have to worry about getting hit by you. Let's just rush in with Tana. And start swinging. No hesitation. Boom. Tana gets hit. Tana won't take too much, thankfully. And she gets a crit just to prove it. Nice. Good experience. Take it. Naomi. Come rushing in. Joshua, follow up. Um, Tana's still okay, so is Garrick, as long as I don't push in too quickly. Or I play it safe however I can. Your axe, but you're not going to move very far. Yeesh, you guys are... Ooh, you put me in a terrible, terrible spot. Or maybe not. Kind of. Hmm. You put me in a spot where I have to decide what's for the best. But the thing is, there is no for the best in this case. What's going to happen is you're going to come running in first. I can already tell. So I can move Vanessa there. You're not going to come in. You're going to move closer, though. Uh, everyone else here is pretty okay. We're going to have friends follow up. Make sure he waits. Calm. Hide it out. Loot. Remain. Well, we're loot. Remain by him by a home E-frame right there, and then we'll keep Moldor pretty far out of range. I mean really far out of range. Lutes might get hit here, but that's okay in all honesty. Ugh. Let's see what happens. Okay, you both are going to rush at me as expected. You're going to move in. You're going straight for Archer. Okay, interesting enough. Not the best idea, but it's something. There we go. I don't have to worry about Archer getting damaged too much. Ooh, I'm almost getting a level up. Weapon level increase. I probably should have given him Anima Magic. Because I'm pretty sure... Okay, never mind. You're going to go for Ross again. Okay, well, Ross can at least hold out pretty well. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. But Ross held out. Thankfully. More units, of course. They're just going to swarm us. Okay, so you're going to use a sword. And you have a javelin. Okay, so I don't want to play this because you put me in such an odd spot. Ross. Well, it's either I heal Archer. No, okay. But back up. No. Up. What do you have? You have iron sword. Okay. Move Ross here. Have him equip the sword slayer. Have him trade real quick. And have him elixir up because Ross needs all the health he king has. Archer, um, you're gonna keep attacking mindlessly, so I'm gonna have Archer just hide it here in the forest. Um, re equip Anima and heal yourself up slowly. Here we go. So this front. How far is your range? Your range goes up to there. You're not making it past the village. Okay. I need to get Tana in a decent position to start swinging. Actually, wait. I just realized I can do something a little ballsy. Naomi, you're gonna come in. Stand right here with your sword. Garrick, you definitely need to heal yourself up. Go. That's good enough for me. Okay. Selena, you can fucking attack wildly, and I hate it, but that's fine. Joshua, come rushing in. Tana, you're gonna go right here. Uh, highest evasion is kill a lance. Tevez, you're gonna dance for Tana. This is risky as all hell what I'm doing, but I'm gonna chance it anyways because... 
high evasion. I'm hoping that it works. Tana, go in and visit the village. Damn, Selena often visits our village when she's on patrol. She even came to our aid when we were attacked by bandits. Please, I beg of you, don't hurt Dame Selena. We receive a talisman. And we can only retreat so far. Oh, no. Okay. Talisman. Increases resistance by two points. Ugh, this puts me in a very terrible position, because that's a steel bow and it's a sniper, so it can dish out so much damage. Not only that, but I'm right in Tana's... I'm right in, um... Selena's range, so she can really mess me up if I'm not careful. Okay, focus. Okay, focus, focus, focus. The way I see it... The way I see it... Franz, come in. Uh, yeah, friends come in and attack you. Boom. So, attack again. Good right there. Okay. You are obviously gonna move in, so I'm gonna have. Yeah, I'm gonna have Vanessa move here. Trade with you the short spear for now. Then make sure you have the axe reaver. Go. Um, so far, no crazy damage. Have loots follow right there. Calm right there. And then we'll just have Moldor. Can I have Moldor wait in there? Yes, I can. A Moldor wait in there. And then my turn. <sighs> okay. Killer Lance is not hitting me. And we're getting a crit just to prove it. Awesome. Okay. That went as just about as good as I could honestly hope for it. As expected, you're gonna retreat. Aim straight for Tana. Because Tana's a really easy target. A crit, that's excellent, thank you. Okay. Things are looking pretty okay. You're also gonna attack, alright. Uh of course, of course, of course! Of course! Of course that happens. Only to me, but it happens. Killer lines broke. I was hoping that wouldn't happen. I was really hoping that wouldn't happen, but it happened anyways. Okay. Ross. Swing KO. That area is good. Ross is fine. If Ross gets attacked, that'd be excellent, though I highly doubt it. Yeesh. Yep, this is the one thing I was worried about. Fuck. That was the one thing I was so spanking worried about. I was like, that is the worst thing that could happen. And it happens. It's fine. <sighs> I'll work on it on my own. You're going to go straight for Archer, okay. At least if it hits him, it's not going to do too much. He'll live. Archer's okay. I really wish we had like a revive of fire or something. Level 2, boosting HP, magic, skill, and resistance. Nice. And of course, more backups up here. Javelin, uh, friend, why don't you come in and use that wonderful, wonderful halberd you got? Boom! Go, just KOing opponents left and right, making our job easier. Kill the lance, okay. You're gonna be a bit of a problem. You're still aiming up here, which is what I'm glad for. Have Ross come over and trade. Return the elixir and weights. Have Archer heal up to the max. There we go. Probably could have just waited another turn, but I not one to chance it really. Um. Okay. Question is, what do I do from here? Killer Lance. Oh no, with an axe reaver. Can't really push in against you too much. I can have, yeah. I can have loot just KO you, so I don't have to worry about fighting you too much. Boom. Do it again. I don't know what kind of check goes uh, the game goes through in order to focus fire on who, but I do know the game goes through a series of checks. I just don't know what kind of check it goes through. 
steel sword, bow, iron sword, okay. You are just destined to aim really anywhere. She's right in her range. Okay, um, how far? Okay, you can't attack very far. You can. So I can do with one of you at least. Uh, let's use a kill alliance of our own. Why not? Bring Coleman. Bring Ephraim in. I'll just keep Mulder back there because right now he's doing pretty well in that little area. Push him with Joshua. Wait in that corner. Have Garrick follow up and have him wait there with the Vulnerary. And then have Naomi just ready with her bows. I'll keep Tethys out of range, of course. And who else? No, that's it. Alright. Yep, that's expected. Go. Boom. Okay, so. The one swing was the one that counted. Iron Blade broke, that's fine. We have another. Yep, I expected you guys are just gonna come rushing at us. I honestly was expecting you. I was, I was expecting you. Go. Two good hits. Crit or not. It's fine. Cool. It's been cleared. We see the bandits just rushing at us. I despise you. I despise you so much. Damn Bowman. You're pushing. You're just jamming straight for me. Okay. Um... I'm gonna do this because this this puts me in a position of what's gonna happen next. Okay. <sighs> Ross is taking loads of damage, but he'll be okay. Selena's taking a liking to him for some reason. More. 